there are around 24 million UK households and in 2002 the number of households owning dogs was 4.8 million. There are around 6.8 million dogs in the UK. It is estimated that the dog population of the UK produces 900 tonnes of faeces every day. Over a 10 year lifetime a dog can produce up to half a tonne of faeces. All faeces contain bacteria that can cause stomach upsets if they have ingested. However, the greatest risk to public health from dog faeces is toxic haristis. I love my job. I get to walk around the park all day, help my friends out, and I only live up the road. I collect mess. It's not all bad. I'm on £15 an hour. That's 30k a year. Walk around the park. How lucky am I? I feel privileged to have a job like this. And I've got a cool job title. I'm a canine faeces collector. The boys call me KFC. I love my job. There's loads of things you can do with dog mess. It's not, it just doesn't have to go to a landfill. You can compost it, it can decompose. There's places in San Francisco that extract the methane. There's loads of things you can do with, with dog mess. I just wish people would be more responsible and look after them, look after their dogs. I'm just about to say, this is my first dog, and it's only now that we've got a dog, you know, it's how many piles of dog poo you see left unattended <laughs> in the park, I can yeah. tell you. You don't see it until you have first start picking it up yourself. Exactly, and anything. Oh, that's disgusting. Why is it something picked it up? Yeah. So um, it is annoying, but I might stick with the donor and pick everything up. Good. So we're going to go. So it's a meeting in the back garden. Massive job, but someone's got to do it. And the best bit, I get to take my dog to work. My dog rocks.